So I'm um, standing in between two swimmers who participated at the uh, maiden edition of the National Swimming Championship that was held last year. Now the second edition is coming off over the weekend at the Bottomon Sports Complex. On my left is Michael Arthur Krabman and on my right is Rachel Lai. Rachel Lai. Okay, so we're just going to have a quick chat. Um, I'll start off with Michael. I mean, he was part of the best male swim team. That's Marlins. I mean, they topped it 63 points. And so I'd like to ask Michael. I mean, Michael, the, the second edition is coming up. You were part of the best swimmers. Um, what are expectations for the second edition? Well, I expect to get the best male swimmer again this year and win the trophy for my team. So I will celebrate and jubilate and everything. You sound so confident. What What's pushing you? Well, my mom, my coaches, and my friends and family. Yeah. Um, apart from that, do you, do you look up to swimmers who are competing for Ghana? So, Abeku Jackson at the African Games, um, Harry Stacey, Giselle. Giselle, yeah, all of them. Would you say that it's it's something that pushes you to also represent Ghana at higher international um, assignment? Oh yes, yeah, very. Okay. Now, walk us through your training sessions. What are some of the things you think that you've done in that period, and you are getting ready for um, what will be organised at the Baltimore Sports Complex? Well, we're basically working on speed and endurance, and for every event that I will do, so that like I'll top every event. Okay. And go good. And and what's your specialty? What's your events you think that you've you've mastered? Well, backstroke and I am. Backstroke. They say backstroke is a difficult one though. Um what can you tell us about that? Well, backstroke is a very easy stroke for me. I don't know for others, but it's very easy for me. It's easy. Yeah. Uh, well, <laughs> what do you think makes it easy for you? What do you think you've mastered to make it easy for you? I mean you should literally be on your back so Yeah, free, like floating, yes. Your final words to people watching this at the Baltimore Sports Complex, what would you say to them if they want to troop in and come watch the uh, Channel One Swimming Championship? Well, come and watch and um, motivate other people to come and swim for the swim league and um, Baltimore. Okay. All right, so that's Michael um, <laughs> sounding very confident that his uh, specialty in the event is the backstroke. And of course, you should come out there and come and watch him. Rachel Lai also represented Marlins. Right. Yeah. Okay, Rachel, um, I can see you are all smiles, you are excited. Um, I mean, what are your thoughts on the second edition coming off at the Baltimore Sports Complex? Yeah, I'm really excited. I'm ready to beat my personal best. I, that's the goal that I have. Yeah, do better than I did last time. Yeah. What was the time for last time? Um, for freestyle, for 53, I'm between the 30s. Okay. I do my PB is about 39. Yeah, so I'm just focusing on improving that time, making it better. Yeah. Uh, I mean, wh how, how are your training sessions like? Um, what are some of the things you go through to get to the optimal best? Well, for training, yeah, as Michael said, we focus on speed, endurance. But yeah, we've also been really focusing on technique, how to keep your technique throughout, even when you're tired. So yeah, it really helps while swimming to improve our times. Okay. Yeah. And what, what's your, your event? What, what, what are you good at? Um, well... I'd say I like to do freestyle, but I think best stroke is best because I like the way I basically flow in the water. It's an easy stroke. I mean, you can really control your speed. Yeah, I just I like that. Okay. Um, I mean, you look at the Baltimore Sports Complex. You, you were part of the Meets of Champions, right? Yeah. Okay, that's Olympic standard pool. How did it feel for you as an athlete when you were in the pool? <laughs> well, yeah, okay. I've been swimming in 50, for 50s, um, I mean, in a 50 meter pool for a long time. So, I mean, I'm used to it. I'm used to it. Just that, like, it was really cold. It was really cold. <laughs> yeah, but then it was it was quite normal for me. I'm yeah. used to it. Is it because it's an indoor uh, facility? So talk about being cold. <sighs> Maybe. I think they regulate the temperature of the water because it's really, really cold. It's freezing. Yeah, one well, of the coldest. I'll swim it. Where, where do you want to see yourself as a young swimmer? Um, where do you want to see your name get to? People talking about your name. Yeah, honestly, well, I want to represent the country, yes. I want to represent the country and competitions, both nationally and internationally. I see myself going far with the swimming, yeah. During the years, I want to really push and go somewhere with it. Is that to say that what Abeku Jackson, Harry Stacey, Giselle Mensah, Harry Stacey and Giselle Mensah are going to uh, represent Ghana at the Olympics. 
is that something that motivates you to keep pushing? Yeah, really, yeah, it does. Your final words to people watching? <laughs> oh, come watch, I'll be really worth it. See you there.